Socks TV. Hello, you're watching Socks TV on Parliament Channel. We've got Parliament on the Sports Channel. We've got the Racing from Cheltenham, and on the Lifestyle Channel, it's time for Sexy Talk. Um, I know some of you have been experiencing a bit of cross-channel interference. We hope that that doesn't spoil your enjoyment of tonight's Good Evening. And tonight we're going to be talking about sexual matters with Lucy. In gate number eight, punters fancy in gate number nine, and Tessa Jowell, who's just emerging from number ten. We're live outside the House of Commons. I'm a single mother living in Boreham Wood. Hello, Lucy. Hello. Lucy, what is it that your partner likes about you physically? Well, Anne, he says that my body is firm underfoot, it's quite warm, and she's very good on the front bench. And what are his best physical features? Well, Anne, he does have powerful fetlocks, a good long stride, and a noticeable swing to the left. The Labour whip is Sir Rodney Folkes. It's his job to prevent the fertilisation of the Prime Minister. And once a horse sets his mind on something like that, you can bet that he'll be through the corridors of power like a spermicidal jelly and into the saddle before you can get out your ordered papers. Now, I understand your first partner was violent? Yes. He once beat me by three and a half furlongs. He did used to buy me kinky underwear. But no sooner has she put the items on her agenda than they're off. Sometimes he would go completely round the bend and then he'll try and pass a motion over my head and into the lobby. That was the first time that I'd seen his right honourable member moving up to the inside and getting close to the dispatch box. So what did you do? I put my foot down on the ceremonial mace and refused the first jump. Tell me about your other sexual partners. Well, there was David. He had 15 hands and needed the full support of the cabinet. I think my favourite was a, was a chap called Big Ben. After we made love, I couldn't budget for the next six months. Had either of them been circumcised? No. So it was neck and neck all the way, and he really has got the bit that is most private and personal to me. Between his teeth, it's blown out of all proportion. Oh dear, he's shooting all over the place. And I don't think Tessa Jowell is going to swallow that. So join us next week when we'll be having multiple orgasms over the hurdles with John Prescott. Good night. Good night. Scottish Falsetto Sock Puppet Theatre. News at 10, Westminster. Sock